Well, my name is George Lardy. I've been a musician most of my life. I'm uh, 70 years old now and still kicking away at it. I've written quite a few of my own songs and stuff. I started out as a guitar player mainly, but I've, uh, after 40 years of guitar, I, my arms wouldn't stay up any higher, so I had to uh, switch to keyboard, so I taught myself keyboard. So I've been playing keyboard since then. I was first diagnosed uh, with muscular dystrophy when I was about a teenager, you know. And, uh, but I always wanted to play guitar, so I learned how to play guitar. Spent years and years playing guitar. And, uh, you know, I was in a couple of bands here and there, played lead guitar, sang a couple times. And I uh, moved out west where I spent a good part of my years there as a picture framer, doing framing pictures and stuff. Of course, I was always playing at the Smithers Music Festival or other places like that, Kispiox. Uh, there's a few out west that I was playing at and helped, you know, as a volunteer in some of the cases. I um, started uh, not being able to play guitar as good as I could at first, you know. And, you know, I'm always jamming with people, so I can always tell when I started to get, you know, basically I started to sound pretty bad. <laughs> So I said, okay, well, it's time to change the instrument. Well, my muscles were getting too weak to hold the guitar up. I couldn't even hold it up, never mind the strum. And uh, quite a few years later, my fingers stopped being able to, I didn't have enough muscle to make a fist. So, uh, but I've been playing the keyboard ever since. And well, I have to play three hours a day because if I don't, then uh, the muscles will forget how to, or they'll get weak. And uh, I won't be able to physically move. I think I'm doing pretty good considering I'm 70 years old. I've been in a wheelchair since 1996. No, I can't. I can't stand up at all. No, my uh, the tendons in the in your hind and behind your legs, the big Achilles tendon or whatever. Uh, you can't even straighten my leg out unless you want to injure me. Well, my arms for the longest time were fairly good. You know, I had biceps and you know. I could strum the guitar pretty good and all that stuff and do work like physical labor. I worked in a factory for four years doing uh, wood shop, you know, cutting up pieces of wood and stuff. Well, I've had, I've gone through several different keyboards and this one is good for me because it's smaller size keys and it's lighter action, but it has some good decent sounds in it. I have to counterbalance everything so I got to you know, push my weight over on one side so I can lift the other side. It's uh, getting, starting to affect me more as I'm older now. I'm starting to get, you know, really feel like cold. I can't handle cold. Like, when I get cold, I can't do anything. I, I can't, I don't have any strength. I, well, for the longest time, I used to have to hold my hands on my knees so I could play the keyboard. And I, but I have to move my knees in order to reach one side to the other. It's, it's a little bit hard sometimes. And I come up with the idea of uh, what if I had a bar across there, I could slide across and hold my hands up, and I wouldn't have to worry about you know hand falling off my knee or something. And uh, then I thought, well, I need these gloves that I have. I need these so that because it slides, you know. It's, if it was just my bare skin, it wouldn't work. It, your hands would just stick to it or whatever. So this just lets me slide up and down. And, and so it works good. Overall, I'm still active, still keep uh, going away with the music and stuff. Still got lots of ideas. And Oh yeah, Muscular Dystrophy Association, uh, they have been really helpful throughout all my past there with uh, helping me partly fund uh, wheelchairs and things like that that I couldn't afford myself. And um, they've been uh, really good. I've, I've heard other things that they've helped other people as well occasionally uh, with if they're having a hardship with trying to fund something. Actually, I held an event for them once uh, a while back before COVID-19 nailed us. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we made a little bit of an event about it there at uh, Tracy's place up on the mountain. We're a good place to go. You can show support for them by uh, giving a donation to Muscular Dystrophy of Canada and uh, then they will uh, 
be most appreciative, I'm sure. And that money does used for other people who come up with muscular dystrophy who need a certain device that they can't afford themselves. And they sometimes they can get it between the government and a couple other funding agencies. So I'm going to do a song called Manipulation that I wrote. Kind of my little protest song. Anyways, here it goes. Manipulation can let you get away with that Manipulation, manipulation We get thin, you get fat Manipulation, manipulation Been going on for many years Manipulation, manipulation Bringing us sweat and tears Gotta sift through it all to find out What is truth or reality can't believe what we hear on the radio or watch at home on TV. We're all hooked up like so many computers programmed every day. Being told what to think, what to buy, what to wear, what to do, and what to say. Oh, manipulation, manipulation. Someone's pulling all the strings. Manipulation, manipulation. It's always the same damn thing Manipulation, manipulation Another tried thought control Manipulation, manipulation The time we're born until we get old Gotta sift through it all to find out what is truth or reality. Can't believe what we hear on the radio or watch at home on TV. We're all hooked up like so many computers programmed every day. Being told what to think, what to buy, what to wear, what to do and what to say. Oh, manipulation, manipulation, can let you get away with that. Manipulation, manipulation We get thin, you get fat Manipulation, manipulation Another try thought control Manipulation, manipulation From the time we're born until we get old From the time we're born until we get old From the time we're born until we get old This next song is a song I wrote a while back. I, I used to like the blues a lot and stuff, so I wrote my own blues version song called What Did I Do Wrong? Tell me, baby, tell me what did I do wrong? Tell me, baby, tell me what did I do wrong? To make you want to leave me sitting sad and all alone Was it something, something that I said or done? Was it something, something that I said or done To make you want to leave me sitting sad and all alone Maybe I had too much whiskey and a little too much wine And might that be the reason why you left me here a crying Well, baby, tell me what did I do wrong Yeah, baby, tell me what did I do wrong To 
make you want to leave me Sitting sad and all alone To hurt your feelings didn't mean to be unkind But drinking too much whiskey makes me lose my mind Well, baby, tell me what did I do wrong Yeah, baby, tell me what did I do wrong To make you want to run away and leave our happy home